we are going to demonstrate the temp turner working as a whole. Right now, I have water which is at, it's at 49.3 degrees Celsius, according to this infrared thermometer. As you can see, the red indicator LED also remains off because we haven't turned on the stove, and therefore there's no possibility of smoke arising yet. Now let's see the app that we have developed. The current temperature shown on our app is 50 degrees Celsius, which shows the high accuracy of our temperature sensor. The red LED is also not visible on the app since there's no smoke. We will now start the scheduler, which will raise the temperature to 60 degrees and 80 degrees, and later bring the temperature down to 40 degrees. Let's wait and see how the system responds to these values. As you just saw and heard, Starting the scheduler results in the motor turning the knob on. Now let's check in on the water as it approaches 60 degrees Celsius. The IR thermometer shows a reading of 61 degrees Celsius. Let's see what the app shows now. The app also shows 59 degree, or 60 degrees Celsius, as you just saw. It's important to note how once the temperature momentarily went above 60 degrees, the internal mechanism of the motor immediately kicked in in order to accordingly maintain the temperature at 60 degrees Celsius. The water has been boiling for quite some time now and it's about to approach 80 degrees Celsius. The IR thermometer shows a reading of 81.8 degrees Celsius. Let's check what the app shows now. The app shows about 81 degrees Celsius. Notice that there is quite a lot of smoke also being visible, and as a result, the red LED indicator is now on. The app also shows the red LED light being on, and the smoke level is at a low level, which makes sense since the smoke sensor is only detecting water vapor. After reaching 80 degrees Celsius, the new target temperature was set to 70 degrees Celsius. Let's check on the status now. The IR thermometer shows a reading of 72.8 degrees Celsius. The smoke sensor is now no longer detecting smoke and therefore it is now off. Let's check what the app is showing now. The app is showing a value of 68 degrees Celsius. The red LED on the app, just as we are seeing here, is off. And the app also has a blank space now for the smoke level since it is not detecting any smoke. We've reached the last scheduled temperature and the water is almost at 40 degrees Celsius. The IR thermometer shows a reading of about 40.2 degrees Celsius. The smoke detector, as seen here, continues to remain off. Let's now see what the app shows. The app also shows a similar value of about 43 degrees Celsius and the red LED on the app also continues to be off. We've now concluded going through all of the scheduled temperatures. This is our camera module and it will show the video in the app. As you can see, user can monitor the stove from their cell phone. One functionality of the temp turner, which we couldn't display while we were boiling water, is the ability of the smoke sensor to also detect gases, including butane, propane, methane, alcohol, and hydrogen. These gases can have concentrations ranging from 200 to 10,000 parts per million. Our system is able to classify the smoke level as being low, medium, and high, based on the amount of gas concentration. To illustrate this, I am now producing butane gas from a lighter. Notice that the red LED turns on when the gas is released, and it turns off when it is not supplied, after a few seconds. The red LED is also turned on in the app, and if you notice, it went to a high momentarily while it was on. The reason why it changed to being at a high level is because of the large concentration of butane gas that it was sensing.